Shalom. I was just here sitting there thinking, if you go go to, uh, I believe it was Roman one when he when uh, the scripture says that nature itself uh, tells you about who Abba is, who Yahweh is. Um, the female bird. Uh, the male bird gets with the female bird and they have intercourse and it's not this long passionate drawn out uh, sexual thing he do what he got to do and moves on uh, they have uh, terrestrial beings uh, terrestrial animals that walk on the earth and then, and then they had those terrestrial beings, celestial beings, that fly above the earth. Um, and everything is in balance. It, it shows you who he is, his nature. It shows you his name is written on the earth. And before the evilness of mankind uh, destroyed that peace that should be on the earth by doing things their own way out of selfish means everything was in balance and in, in, in course and then even his nature it tell, he showed you his name by his by the, by by the actions of the world if he was the terrible being that people try to say he is he would it, it would be no earth because all of us he's a righteous elo elo so if he's, since he's so righteous um he had destroyed it right at the, after he had, had uh, let after no one of them got off the boat. He had destroyed it again. <laughs> it would have been continuous destruction because he would just destroy it all the time. Because, but he's not. He's not like that. He's he's kind. He's peaceable, patient. He's not no punk. But it's a day called the day of Yahweh that's coming. So. I said all that to say this. If you really want to know if you are Israelite or not, examine your nature. Nature itself will di dictate who you are. The EB, Ebri, Ebo, uh, indigenous people have always been, been declared to be a peaceable people. A kind people, people that would give you the last the shirt off their back. That don't mean they punks, they just kind. And people take that and those evil ones with the serpent, cold blooded nature, take advantage of these people and try to come in and smile and stab them in the back and kill them and do all those things to these peaceable people who was doing nothing but was trying to extend hospitality towards you. That, and I made a video, I, I, this is why I know that I'm Ebri, indigenous, M-U-U-R. This is why I know I'm that, because my very nature tells me who I am. Now, I've been skilled in many things, but I don't boast in that. I'm not saying I don't have no, any man that says he has no sin, he's a liar. So I'm not saying I don't have a sinful nature, because that's what this flesh is. But I have the nature of Yahuwah written on me. It makes me peaceable and kind, patient, long-suffering. I have a lot of the fruit of the Spirit. I'm not boasting, I'm just saying, say nature itself shall tell you, tells you who Elo is. Nature itself will tell you who Elo's people are. So, that's just a thought I want to share with you. That maybe you can consider your nature and see who you are. So, I say this in love and in peace because that thought came to me say nature itself will tell you so you indigenous you here on the the land of what they call Morocco Turtle Island northwest of Mexico California
and 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 that and, and then they say the copper color. So you put all that stuff together, then that that looks that looks a little like me, like me. <laughs> you too, but I don't know who I'm talking to. So I say, look, I like, thank you too. But um, and like I said, that's not boastful. That's not putting no, nobody down. But I'm just saying, consider nature itself will 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 gives you perfect insight into who is who. And definitions and documentations and historical documents and it's just so much that's coming to the light too you know you can't deny the truth all right shalom